The circulatory system in leaving cert biology is quite a long topic. So what do you need to know? How do you organise your revision? Well, start off by learning all about blood. Learn about the blood cells, their function, etc., the plasma and the blood groups. Next, be able to explain what is meant by a closed circulatory system, what are the benefits of this, and what is meant by an open circulatory system. So next, concentrate on the blood vessels, and remember these are the tubes in which the blood flows, and this section is all about diagrams, be able to draw and label them. Next, focus on the heart, the structure of the heart, draw a really good diagram and know the four chambers, the blood vessels leading into and out of the heart, the valves, and the number of flaps, and the pericardium. So when you know the structure of the heart really well, go on to blood flow. So know what is meant by double circulation, the pulmonary and the systemic circuits. Where is the blood going to? So next go on and study the cardiac cycle, a really important part of the topic. Know all about the pacemaker and the AV node. Know about diastole and systole and the lub-dub sound. So when you're comfortable with the cardiac cycle, go on to blood pressure, be able to define blood pressure and be able to define pulse. So next go on and study the effects of smoking, diet and exercise on the circulatory system. Why is smoking so bad? Why is eating a diet high in fat and salt bad? And why is exercise good? So finally, there are two practicals connected with this topic, the heart dissection and the effect of exercise on pulse rate. So remember, study this topic in chunks. There are other videos and use your textbooks.